It is not Zeus's fault that he had so many affairs, at least not entirely. Don't get me wrong, that dude had very little self-control when it came to keeping it in his pants, but your boy Cupid didn't make things any easier for him. See, Cupid, or Eros as he's known in Greek myth, knew that even the gods themselves were no match for the power of love, and so he found it quite hilarious to make the all-powerful Olympians weak in the knees for mere mortals. Even better if he could hit the target of their affection with a lead arrow, which made them repulsed by the would-be lover. According to a poet named Nanus, Eros had 12 of his enchanted golden arrows set aside for Zeus specifically, and every one had the name of his potential lover carved into it. Those names included Europa, Danae, Semele, Queen Leda, and many more. And while it's kind of a shitty thing to do to a married man, if it weren't for those arrows, we may not have gods like Dionysus, heroes like Perseus, or a myth where a queen bangs a swan. So I'd say it was worth it. Just don't ask Hera's opinion.